self-improvement ruined my life. Have you ever felt like self-improvement has taken over your life? In today's video, we'll explore how the pursuit of personal growth can sometimes go too far and share some tips on finding balance. So, let's dive in. Picture this, you're on a quest to become the best version of yourself. You're reading self-help books, attending workshops, and setting ambitious goals. But somewhere along the line, you start to feel overwhelmed, stressed, and even unhappy. What went wrong? The truth is, self-improvement can become an addiction. Just like any other addiction, it can consume your life and leave you feeling empty. So, how can you strike a balance between personal growth and living a fulfilling life? Here are some tips. 1. Set realistic goals. It's essential to set achievable goals that align with your values and priorities. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither will your ideal self. So, break your goals down into smaller, manageable steps and celebrate your progress along the way. 2. Embrace imperfection. Nobody's perfect, and that's okay. Embrace your flaws and learn to accept yourself as you are. Remember. Self-improvement is about growth, not perfection. So, focus on progress, not perfection, and give yourself permission to make mistakes. 3. Prioritize self-care. It's crucial to take care of your physical, emotional, and mental well-being. Make time for activities that bring you joy, relaxation, and connection with others. Remember. Self-improvement isn't just about achieving goals, it's also about nurturing your overall well-being. 4. Find Balance Don't let self-improvement consume your entire life. Make sure to maintain a healthy balance between personal growth and other aspects of your life, such as work, relationships, and hobbies. Remember, a well-rounded life is a happy life. 5. Practice Gratitude Instead of constantly striving for more, take a moment to appreciate what you already have. Practicing gratitude can help you stay grounded and remind you of the progress you've already made. So, take time each day to reflect on the things you're grateful for. Now, let's talk about some real-life examples of how self-improvement can go wrong and how to avoid these pitfalls. 6. The Perfectionist Trap some people become obsessed with self-improvement and end up setting impossibly high standards for themselves. This can lead to burnout, stress, and even depression. To avoid this trap, remember that it's okay to be imperfect and that progress is more important than perfection. 7. The Comparison Game Comparing yourself to others can be a dangerous game. It's easy to feel inadequate when you see others achieving their goals faster or more easily than you. Instead of comparing yourself to others, focus on your own journey and celebrate your unique achievements. 8. The Never-Ending Quest It's essential to recognize when you've reached a healthy level of self-improvement and when it's time to shift your focus to other areas of your life. Remember, personal growth is important but so is living a fulfilling and balanced life. 9. Learn to say no. In the pursuit of self-improvement, it's easy to take on too many commitments and stretch yourself too thin. Learning to say no to unnecessary obligations can help you maintain balance and focus on what truly matters. Remember, it's okay to prioritize your well-being and personal growth over pleasing others. We hope you found this video insightful and helpful in your journey to finding balance and self-improvement. If you enjoyed this video and learned something new, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Psychology Facts for more amazing content. And as always, we love hearing from our community, so share your thoughts, experiences, and any questions you might have in the comments below. Let's keep the conversation going and learn from each other.